Hi, I have finally received my quantum energy medallion. Inside the box, there's a card of authenticity, which I don't really need. And of course we got our medallion. It's made from a lava stone which has a really nice matte black color. There's also a rubber ring around it for additional protection. What I find interesting is the fact that this medallion appears to be radioactive. But why? In order to find out, I will use a race ID gamma spectrometer for isotope identification. Here's the spectrum after 4 hours and 15 minutes. As we can see, race ID automatically identified different energy peaks. Here's the same spectrum, but with my annotations. All peaks detected by race ID seem to be within 1% error range, very impressive considering its size. The peak on the left, at 78 keV, comes from X-ray fluorescence. There are two peaks from actinium-228, at 129 keV, and 338 kV. The peak at 238 kV is from lead 212, and the peak at 583 kV is from thallium 208. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to identify peaks at 43 kV and 682 kV. The isotopes detected are daughters of thorium 232, and as you can see, race ID already informs us about possible thorium content. Conclusion. Traces of thorium can be found in lava, which makes it slightly radioactive. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribe for more content. Cheers.